Hello everyone! No, I'm sorry, we don't have time for a full Bioink Redemption video today. I just wanted to go over a quick status update on my World of Warcraft Classic experience because I know you're all just waiting with bated breath. I know I'm being a bit sarcastic and over the top here. Excuse me. So, yeah. Got the 48 on my Paladin, finally got full plate. I had to replace those the gift my guildy gave me on my uh, hands just because I was getting a bit embarrassed at level 48 not having full plate and I decided to just eventually buy that. And for those of you with the eagle eye, you'll be able to notice the blue BOE weapon I've been using. That's a level 47 BOE named Stone Raven that I got for cheap. It's already paid for itself on the auction, or paid for itself. I got it for, I think, 10 gold. I farmed about 6 gold worth of leather while leveling the weapon skill with it, and uh, I can sell it for about 4 gold when I vendor it. So, nothing really of value lost there, to be fair. Um, plus, I gotta sell my uh, Bone Biter, which was another 2 gold, so I've actually kind of, I don't want to say made money, but uh, it's not always terrible to buy blues if you're like a Red Paladin or an Arms Warrior, for example. Possibly Rogue, but I don't play Rogue, so I don't know. Just don't go buku crazy buying weapons, like you don't need a bl new blue weapon every 10 levels. I bought two weapons this entire time on my uh, Paladin. I bought my, uh, my, how much did my thing sell for? Wow, both of them sold. Holy shit. Um, both of giant eggs sold. But yeah, I've bought a level 25 mace because my last weapon at that time was a level 15 mace and then Stone Raven. I bought two weapons. Both really sped up my leveling process. Highly recommended, by the way. Let's do a full scan while I'm yammering on. Because I haven't scanned in, I haven't scanned today yet. Really should have done that before I put shit up to sell, but to be fair, it scans when you put things up anyway, so it's just kind of a for everything else kind of thing. Anyway. Yeah. Feeling pretty good. Oh, I got more Wicked Claws here. I need to put in my bank. I forgot all about that stuff. <laughs> I think I almost have enough for like half my Lionheart Helm and my Warrior at this point. Which is kind of cool. <laughs> I don't remember exactly what all you need for a Lionheart Helm, but when the time comes, my Warrior's gonna have a Lionheart Helm, bitches. That's right. I mean, I won't be able to use it very effectively, considering I won't be in a raiding guild for quite a while, but if I ever do get in one, I'm, I'm gold, man. Excuse me. Where's that? Where are they at? There they are. Okay, my bank is full, because I'm a dumb dumb sometimes. Um Inventory management. Inventory is full. Let's see. You don't need to hold three silver bars. These are hold way more weight than that. So you put that uh here. They don't look terrible, it don't look good, but it don't look terrible. Bark, why is everything like like Tetris here? I don't know, okay? They're just it just is. Have a good one. Also, I refuse to believe Stay that there. the knife fin will actually sell, but they claim that they're almost like worth a gold each. And I put later. twenty on the auction house earlier, and if that's the case, huh, well I'm gonna be fishing up a lot more night fin in the future. Did that say it sold? I didn't look at the night at the night uh fin in the auction house. But yeah, holy crap, that dude still got Varrigan's Fist at 35. I never got Varrigan's Fist this time, just because I never really took the time to go do dungeons. Except I went through Scarlet Monastery once, and that was, uh, that was a hell of a thing, healing a two-hand warrior through that who was underleveled, but I did it anyway. Yeah, I didn't think that would be... selling. But on the off chance it does... I'm rich. Well, I mean, I'm already... some people would call me rich already, but, uh... I only have 230, I have about 240 gold across all my characters, which isn't even enough to like, it's like barely more than a fifth of what I need for one epic mount. But anyway, that's all I got for today. I know it's not exactly substantial, but I don't want this video to go on too long. I don't want to go into reasons why. But for those who are wondering about my uh, Paladin's gear, because I'm sure somebody somewhere might maybe, I doubt it, but... Um, I've sold so many upgrades to this, but hey, I got this, so I don't need anything better. I think I got full plate. <laughs> That's so nuts from Ashen Vale. Holy shit, I still have that ring. Um, let's see. That's from a rare drop. These two, I think I bought. I know I bought this. Uh, 
and that's about it. I only bought a couple things for my paladin this whole time. Feels pretty good. So, that's all I got for today, everyone. Oh, I guess you might actually give a crap about my talents, and yes, I'm finally getting able to put points in holy. I can't wait to get spiritual focus maxed out, and then I won't, you know, I'll be a lot tankier with spiritual focus. All I have to do is pop on concentration aura, pop off a heal, boom. Easy. That's the main draw of leveling holy anyway, so you can be tankier while leveling. And yes, I had a crisis over Divine Strength or Divine Intellect, but I figured, well, I'm leveling red, I guess I might as well go with Divine Strength. I can't wait till 51 either, so I can finally get Consecrate, even though its mana to damage ratio is absolutely shit. But it's AoE nonetheless, I've been AoE grinding with the guildy, so I, could, I wouldn't feel quite as useless then. Because right now, it's just like, I can single target things while he blizzards, and then maybe pop a heal when he gets, uh, whoopsie too close. <laughs> That's about all I can do. And, uh, that's all I got. I mean, I leveled a Hunter, uh, I leveled my Warrior. This is in order of, uh, importance to me, and yes, the Bank Ult is above the Hunter. <laughs> Actually, the Mage is probably above the Hunter, because I enjoy Mage more than Hunter. I just don't like Hunter that much. I mean, it's easy. I soloed Oakenskowl. I mean, my Paladin had a Druid help her, and it is still a little bit diff little challenging. Probably could have soloed it on my paladin, but it would have been harder than my than the than the hunter was. Paladins can solo a lot of elites. Hunters can solo them easier, which makes sense. But yeah, it's not a bad class. It's just not my class. You know, I can see why people love hunter. I just don't really. I love warriors. I love paladins. I love up in your face, smashy smasher, up in the front line of the battlefield, healing people. That's just what I like. That's all I have two bank ults. I forgot I do have another bank ult. Um, I do recommend people have one, at least one, sometimes two bank ults, depending. Because one bank ult sometimes just doesn't have enough storage space. I'll show you my second bank storage space just so you can see how packed it is. Oh, she has mail. Okay, well, she yeah, mostly, as you can tell, I mostly send her food items. I don't know why, but I do. Uh, but yeah. It just makes sense thematically, I don't know. But, yeah, she don't have a whole lot of money. <laughs> because she's kind of new, and I just sent her enough to buy a couple bank spaces and some bags, and... Hello. Next time I find, when she finally gets 10 gold, I'll purchase that. Here's this silk pack, and then uh, have some more. I did send her the stone scale yield, that's good. How's that going for 48 silver? It was just going for 8 silver. Okay, I'm not arguing, I mean, I, it's good for me, but... Uh, Okay, then. <laughs> we will put you in there, and I don't really have much else I can put in there, do I? Well, I guess I can put you in there. Move you over here, just, I don't know why, but we're doing it. See you around. But yeah, it's actually cheaper to have two, banks, two bank characters. I mean, unless you want to have, uh, no, thank you. Uh, this is why I hate having people just spam shit like that. Anyway, that's all I got. No more yammering, no more pointless blithering. That's all I got for today. So, I will see you all next time. Don't know what I'll have for you tomorrow. Probably a, uh... Probably my next farm spot for those who are in the high 40s. And that's a really good farm spot. You know, so I got all those giant eggs, and, uh stuff from that's easy money right now I'll show you where to get that it's very easy actually very easy along with rugged leather which is very good as well it's better than thick leather thick leather is pretty good money so look forward to that and thursday we'll probably be back to bioink redemption so until then everyone until then later <laughs>